Hey guys! Greetings from Kentucky. We are here back again giving y'all a little update on our last couple weeks. Oh, we saw our first <laughs> snow! Oh yeah, that was cool. Yes, you will see a lot of footage of it. Even though there's not a lot of snow, so, there's a lot of footage. Tiny bit of snow. <laughs> The kids are so excited. We might have had a little too. What's it? What's it when it's like rain, but like icy rain, but not like hail. Like it, it's like a slushy in the sky. <laughs> slushy in the sky. I got slushy today. I feel like there's a tech. I feel like sleet is the right word for that. <laughs> Guys, it's so strange. Like it might seem like we're obsessing over the weather, but this is the thing. Okay, this is the thing. We've only seen seasons in books. <laughs> We've only seen pictures of seasons. Or like vacation. For like a week when we were like 10. Like, like even as like singles, we would go to like the Caribbean and South America. <laughs> we did not go north, right? Yeah, pretty we, much. Like, yeah, we don't, it's like we're on a different planet. <laughs> now I know why everyone wants to like lose weight afterwards when they're like, oh, summertime's coming, get your summer body. I never understood that before. Cause all you want to do is eat and you're wearing a hundred layers. So like, it doesn't even matter anyways. It's like, you're just cold and just hungry. <laughs> So we ended last video by asking for prayer because I was going to be having Tuesday and Thursday free without the kids for a couple hours and it went so well. Thank you so much for your prayers. Um, I was able to sit in on two of David's classes where they talked about family worship and it was just great to hear Donna Whitney's thoughts and I, I think it really inspired both of us and even since then um, just been more faithful and even having a better understanding of what family worship is and it's been really del like the kids love it I love it uh, it's been a really really sweet time yeah there were some great takeaways from I feel like from his lectures it doesn't have to be long um, it's about consistency that every day we worship God because we love God um, and then also that like you don't have to prepare it's not a sermon um, you know, Donna Whitney, who's like the spiritual disciplines guru, was like, never once have I actually prepared. I just read the Bible to them and pray to God and worship Him. And that was so like freeing to just, and it, it could be like five minutes just reading, it could be one verse that you read to them and then pray and worship together, just showing them what you really value. Oh, I have kind of a silly answer to prayer. So I've gone to Southern Exchange a couple times and I just haven't found anything, which is fine, but um, it got really cold today, <laughs> like really, really cold. And boots are really expensive. And um, I, we, I was like, I'm just gonna try one more time. I'm gonna go to Southern Exchange. If, it's, if I don't find anything, I'm not going back. It's at a really hard time. It's right during the baby's nap time. Southern Exchange is the free thrift store that Southern offers to its students. So. Yes, with four little kids in a very cramped area where they're all trying to grab like a million things and it can be a little overwhelming. So anyways, we went today and I was just praying. Like the whole time I was just like, God, I just pray that there would be boots there. Like I would be able to find some boots. And there were two pairs of boots, not one. Two pairs that fit me perfectly and one of them is like a really good brand that I've been recommended and it was just such a huge answer to prayer it was so huge because it's cold <laughs> that's a bit of a theme uh... <laughs> it's cold guys it's painfully cold like it's Thanksgiving no have you ever walked through a field where the wind is blowing in your face it's already 20 degrees <laughs> Now it feels like it's zero degrees. There are like tears coming out of your eyeballs. Your nose is just, it's, I'm not even sick right now. Like I'm actually not sick. And there's like snot running down my nose and the kids are all like running through this field. Solomon doesn't even have a sweater on. He just has a sleeve shirt. It's gonna be a way longer it's video. It's actually it painful. It's actually pain, like painful. Okay, I'm done. We have to trim that down. We'll wear the right clothes and then we'll all be like, oh, what do you want to So about a week ago, took the kids on a surprise trip to Georgia. You'll see some footage of that at the end here. And it was super fun, very refreshing. Um, 
even just driving like eight hours south, I know this is all about the weather. <laughs> but I have... No, the weather just no, the weather was different listen. here too. No, it was no, different here too. The sun was brighter. It was shining brighter in Georgia, and the weather the was came, like amazing. The sun came out here. It was just it was a nice couple days. <laughs> but it was a really great time, and um, we were. It was. It was. Yeah. That's all. <laughs> Part of the reason as well for them uh, going to visit my parents in Georgia was to give me some time to make some progress on my term papers. I have three papers due this weekend and a couple final exams. And um, so they left, which meant I stayed back and just studied day and night. Um, and it was really, really fruitful. Actually, God really blessed the time. I was kind of nervous that I'd just completely collapse. And that's also just a prayer request. You know, you can be praying for finals uh, this week and papers and all of that. It's all kind of coming together at the same time uh, as it typically does with school. And uh, just finish strong. The last prayer request, it's kind of involving the weather as well. <laughs> no, but seriously, um, like seasonal, what is it called? Seasonal affective disorder. Seasonal, Sad. Seasonal affective disorder. Um, it's something I've always heard about, but never really like known what it was. And I feel like I definitely am experiencing that right now. And just I've, I've just never experienced not seeing the sun for this long, and the sun setting so early, and the cold weather, and everything. So I just love prayer for me, and even for the kids. I've just been doing some research on stuff that we can like vitamins we can be taking, and um, they just sometimes are like super gloomy and so yeah that God would just give us just joy like that we would really like fully be able to accept this and have joy in it and like even getting those boots it might seem really silly but it's like I'm so excited like I'm ready for this weather I'm preparing myself because <laughs> if not you literally just like just want to be in bed just covered in blankets and like not even move all day and that's not healthy and that's not how I want to live so um that would just be a prayer request that like we have joy through this season. It is fun. It is new. It is exciting, but it also comes with some other stuff as well. That's that's also new and not so exciting. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it. Well, guys, thanks for coming along this journey with us. Um, we love you all. We're grateful for your prayers, and uh, we'll talk to you again soon. Bye. Bye. It is. It's great. Um, so I don't know if you can see the difference in these tips. There are a lot of smaller ones, um, but the ones with the larger circle are the ones that I generally like to use for cupcakes. <laughs> <Ta -da>! <laughs> <laughs> We are currently taking all their candies away except for one piece each. This is not original to us, by the way. Jimmy Kimmel is the one who started this. I don't think you they're going to buy it. I think they're going to know. Okay, so I think Solomon is going to scream and cry. No. I think MJ is going to get very upset because she knows that I'm Miss Healthy. I think Annabelle is going to try to find, like, to not the be... Sil the silver lining? Yes. I ate some of your candy last night. And we got some... A lot of your candy. Okay, but this is the thing. We got really bad stomach. <laughs> okay, look, look. We left one candy for you guys to be able to have some candy. The rest we just threw away. Because we don't want you to get sick like us. Yeah. Buddy, it's okay. We just... We don't, we don't want you to get sick. So we just gave you some. So much. Is that okay, guys? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. You would have the funniest stomach ache ever. All I know is that this is my first candy. Yellow. I ate three last night. Sorry I for eating this. all your candy. Eh. These are all the candies we ate in the car. No, I ate half of those candies. Sorry. Wow, you're really out here talking about exercise and stuff. <laughs> off of my exercise and stuff. Well, I <laughs> I'm really off track, guys. This is what Holland does to you. I always knew why they called fall fall because like the leaves fell but literally from one day to the next like yesterday you could see grass on the ground and now look at our backyard but look at the ground this is crazy like I've I've never experienced this in my life okay the leaves all over the place <laughs> I know <laughs> have you ever seen this before no what do you think happened? The leaves fell off, and look at our tree. I know. <laughs> do you think it's dead? Yes. What's gonna happen? Oh my goodness! <laughs> That's how I feel. Tomorrow morning, I am surprising them. I'm gonna wake them up at six o'clock in the morning, throw them in the car, and we are driving to Georgia. I'm gonna be going by myself with all four kids, so this could be really interesting. Um, so I'm like super hype. They're watching a show, so I'm gonna sneak into the room and get their suitcases. Okay, the first clue is, it starts with a G and ends with an A. Very special people. Do they live in a place that starts with a G and ends with an A? Yes, Georgia! We are right now driving to Georgia. We're going to Georgia! Holy we found the dad! Um, so I have something else to tell you. What else? Nana doesn't know. It's going to be a surprise for Nana too. That's why it's taking so long. That's why it's taking so long. That's why it's taking so long. I'm like, what place takes seven hours? <laughs> Okay, so we are 10 minutes away from Pops and Nana's house. We're in Athens, Georgia, and I did not record anything. That entire trip was, <laughs> I feel like I was holding my breath for eight hours. <laughs> we are now in public. So happy. And you guys ready to surprise Nana? Get down. Nope, she's not on the porch. Okay. <laughs> she's got the garage door. Surprise! <laughs> yeah, go. You want to go give her huggies? <laughs> Okay, say cheese. Oh yeah, yeah, I see your hat. Can you say cheese? That's a great sun, buddy. That's really a good job. Now, what color do you color it in with? Tell me about your sign here. Banana colored cloud. What does it say? Yeah. We'll put a little bit of blue in there. And what made you think about that? Then there'll be more peace yes. if you share. I like it. Annabelle, what does yours say? Help one another. Help one another? And what inspired you to write that? To help people when they're scared. When they're scared, you can help people? I love your words. They're so pretty.
That instrument's like three times her size. <laughs> Gonna go and see Nana? Yeah. Nana's sleeping. Okay. I do not know what she just said. Are you singing? Go to the shed. Okay. Oli, are you helping? Yeah. Are you helping Pops? Has he been working out here this whole time? Yeah, the whole thing. Super dirty. It is a sock and it got dirty in the woods. Oh no. Oh, my. oh yeah, the sock. Touch it. <laughs> it's solid. So it was in the 20s last night. Annabelle, what did we find this morning? Ice! Show me. In our bed. What did you find? What else? Snow! Show me. In Show me. Ice! Show me the snow. Fine! Snow! Snow! Oh snow. my goodness, is that, is that snow? snow? Yes, it is true. Uh, that tastes good. <laughs> oh my gosh, are you eating snow off the slide? <laughs> ice! Ice! It's da -da -da -da. So I guess today was the first snow. I just woke up. Um, <laughs> tasty! Yummy. Oh my snow. god. <laughs> They're eating the snow. It looks like sand. It's snow. Mary Jane was like, now we can make ice cones and snow ice cream. <laughs> Maybe it's enough to make a snow cone for like an ant. How are you not freezing right now? You're crazy. Oh, what are you guys doing? Who needs a rake when you've got four kids? <laughs> Good job, guys. <laughs> 